again. Please give it up for Budo Fights 8, everybody. Thank you for coming. I'm Skander from NW Fight Team. Let's first get started off with the main event. Desert Dog Fighter, Philip Gebauer. Philip Gebauer, give it up for Philip Gebauer from the Desert Dogs at a catch weight of 150 pounds. He's got a new haircut, he's looking good. Hundred and fifty pounds even. Give it up for Philip Cabauer from the Desert Dogs. Phil is from the Desert Dogs right here in Bend, Oregon. Coach JT Taylor knows how to pose. All right, his opponent from Midtown MMA, Levi Weichel. Give it up for Levi Weichel from Midtown MMA. This fight is at a catch weight of 150 pounds. One fifty point five. All right, we got to do a face off. All right, this is your professional main event, you guys, for tomorrow night. These guys mean business. Phil, you are from Bend. People here yeah. love you. People have been rooting for you. You are the professional. You got a beautiful haircut. Uh, you've been training hard. Oh, really hard. Yep. Uh, what do you What do you think about your opponent? Uh, I think he's a really tough guy. Um, I know we've kind of been on a collision course for a while, so I'm really excited to fight him and see what happens. It's my favorite beard. I love to see that beard. Give it up for the best beard in town, Jared Matthews. This is for the title bout, 205 pounds. 200.5, he didn't even need the 205. 205 pound title bout, independent Jared Matthews, give it up. Jared, you're fighting for a title tomorrow. How you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good. Feeling, feeling a lot quicker and a lot lighter than I have been. You didn't need the five pounds, man. You, you've been cutting a lot of weight. Uh, how's the cut been? To tell you the truth, it hasn't been too bad. Um, I started back about February, March, so really it's just been in the last couple days. It's been kind of iffy, but not too bad. <laughs> you've been in a lot of wars in this cage at Midtown, and you're fighting a, another tough, tough guy, Jason Pittman. How do you feel about that? I feel good. I think we're going to put on a good show. All right, man. Well, let's get him in here, get him weighed in, get you guys faced off. Next up, Jason Pittman from 503 West Coast Jiu-Jitsu. Jason Pittman, give it up. 205 title. Hey, I, I got nice glasses. We got to be on TV. 202. They didn't need 205. He's at 202. Give it up for 503 West Coast Jiu-Jitsu's Jason Pittman. Let's get that belt. He wants the belt too. Both these men want the belt. We got a title belt. We got a title bout. All right, let's get a face off, you guys. The 205 title, who's gonna take it home? All right, we're good, we're good at 125 pounds in a rematch. Victor Submission Fighting Academy Team Mini Ninja, Alex Corrales. Give it up from Bend, Oregon, Alex Corrales. I just dubbed him Team Mini Ninja. You knew I was gonna say it too. Hundred twenty-three point five for Alex Corrales. Now, um, what do you think about uh, Team Mini Ninja? Are you gonna keep that? Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. I gave it to you. You had to keep it. Yes, I will keep it. All right. Uh, how's training been? It's been really good. Uh, I've been getting a lot of good mix training in. Uh, training with Jimmy in the morning, striking, and Eric at night, uh, jujitsu. So I feel real ready to go. Now, um, your opponent, Adam King. This fight, uh, you win. Won this fight. Bad, bad, bad. Talk about the fight. Uh, yeah, we fought for the belt at the FCFF uh, a few months ago. He beat me, and 
I've been wanting revenge on this fight for a while, so uh, yeah, I hope I hope he shows up tomorrow and we can uh, throw down. You've been really wanting to bend too. Uh, how, to, how much does it mean for you to have him bend? Uh, it means a lot. I get to fight in front of a bunch of people that are coming out to support me, so uh, I never got to fight at home, so it's gonna be good. I can't wait to hear the crowd cheer when I walk out. So. All right, well, you hear it here. Team Mini Ninja, Victor Submission Fighting Team, Alex Corrales here in Ben. Come support him. Alex Corrales. Give it up for Alex Corrales. His opponent, Adam King from Team Chaos, will be weighing in tomorrow morning. That's, I'm telling you, you're going to be one of the sleeper fights on the card. Do not miss that fight. Next up, from here in Bend, Oregon, Team Reacts, Greg Carlson. Greg Carlson, one of the winners of Northwest Fight Scenes, MMA Fights. MMA Mixed Martial Arts Wards of the Year. Jeez, I really just messed that up, and that's my show. <laughs> it is not easy to have the mic in your face. Anyways, Greg Carlson, where are you at? Get up here. Greg Carlson. He knows what he won. He won a nice plaque. You better win another one. Greg Carlson, 170 pounds, fighting Cody Viasquez. And he's turning around. What was that? 168.5. Everybody's making weight tonight. 168.5. All business tonight. And he ain't even talking to me. That's fine. No, it's cool. All business. Do your thing. Cody Viasquez, where you at? Cody Viasquez at 170, and they're both turning their backs to the crowd. They are all business. 171 even. All right. We got a 170-pound fight. Let's get a face-off, gentlemen, right here in the middle. Scoot in, scoot in. All right. What a welterweight bout this is going to be, you guys. Shake hands. We appreciate it. All right. Go out this way, you guys. That's going to be a great bout, I'm telling you. All right. And another bout. This is a 185-pound Desert Dog Fighter, Dustin Duffy. Where's Desert Dog Fighter, Dustin Duffy? And he knows how to pose, too. Hundred and eighty-two pounds for Duffy. Get your kid. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't. I got a microphone. You ain't going nowhere. Hundred and eighty-five pounds for Desert Dog Dustin Duffy. Duffy, you're training with the Desert Dogs. You guys have been fighting here. You guys have been fighting here. JT fought here years, long time. How's it feel to fight here in a place that JT helped create? Man, it's awesome. I mean. This is my first fight, you know, and JT hit me up right after my first fight, and I've been with him ever since, and I couldn't imagine going anywhere but with him. Now, um, how much do you know about Brandon Nunn? Uh, not too much. I mean, I watched him fight a couple times on YouTube, and I don't know, it'll be a fun fight. Um, talk, what, do you, what is everybody going to expect to see tomorrow night? Scrapping it out. Scrapping it out from Dustin Duffy, everybody. Give it up for Dustin Duffy. <laughs> All right, his opponent, Brandon Nunn from Team Chaos, will be weighing in tomorrow as well. So let's move right down to Chris Turin from the Desert Dogs and Mike Gonzalez. Chris Turin first from the Desert Dogs. Let's give it 170.5. 170.5. For Chris Turin. 168.5 from Mike Gonzalez from Smith Martial Arts. All right, let's get a face-off. We got a face-off from the hometown fight, Chris Turin versus Mike Gonzalez at 170 pounds. Let's give it up for the hometown fight. That's why we're calling this local motion from Budo Fights 8. Give it up for your local guys. One fifty five even for Raul Bello. One fifty five even. Let's get a face off, gentlemen, right here in the front. Let's get in a little bit. All right, guys, we have a one hundred and fifty five pound fight.
All right, guys, thank you very much. David McManus versus whoever wants to fight him. 145 to 155. Anybody wants to step up? 150 even. 150 even. Give it up one more time for Danger David McManus. I want to give it up to all the people that are helping sponsor, all the people that put this together. Let's give it up for Paul Heatherman, the person that put this together. Paul Heatherman, there would be no Budo. He's helping put food for the fighters. He's helping bring you guys together. He takes care of this. Let's give it up for Budo Fights, Black Eye Bends, Blend, the beer, everybody loves alcohol, right? Let's give it up for Tussle Fight Gear and the girls that they put together. Everybody loves girl fights. Let's give it up for Northwest Fight Scene. Cool glasses. Let's give it up for the Liquid Lounge. Who's going to the after party and hanging out with me at the after party? Anybody going to the after party and hanging out and going drinking after people get punched in the face? Let's do this. Let's give it up to all these sponsors, Smith Martial Arts, the Desert Dogs, all the fighters, all the people that get punched in the face for free. That's all you guys, so give it up for all you guys and the fighters who are doing this for free. I love all you people. I've been doing this for a long time, so let's give it up for that. Let's get on to the last one, and that's the female bouts. Let's give it up to the female bouts. First up, Crystal Jewel from Team React. Give it up for Crystal Jewel. First weighing in, bring it on down. Crystal Jewel. One oh five. Probably one oh two. I'm just kidding. Yeah, here, hold this. Ninety seven pounds even. I told you. I didn't even have to lie. I know her. I don't have to lie. All right, versus CrossFit Ben Central's Brandy Brown. Come on, give it up, you guys. We have a female bout on the card, and you guys know you like female fighting, so give it up. One hundred and seven point five pounds. Okay, let's get a face off. All right, give it up. Look at that face off. That might be a personal beef we have. All right, and we have a fight. Give it up for Crystal Jewel for taking that fight even without the weight. I think we got a personal beef here, you guys. Give it up for the female bows. And so far, we got a fight card. Thank you very much for showing up.